Well, the important part of building a house in this, in this part of the world in terms of specific to this area is letting the sun into the house. You've got to be able to design the house so that the sun can get in. The high altitude here, we get a lot more, the sun is a lot more intense, but the actual ambient temperature of the air is not. So I always tell people that whenever you come to this area, don't be fooled by the nice cool climate because you'll get sunburnt 10 times worse than you will at Coffs Arbor. Um, but that's just, you like, you get a lot more heat from the sun, so you, you need to allow for that in your house. If you've sort of blocked the sun out, the house is, doesn't matter how well insulated it are, unless you're prepared to spend a lot of money on aircon, um, it's just going to be cold and miserable. It comes down to how elaborate the house design is. I mean, you can have drop gables with windows that only let the sun in in the summertime, uh, and they, that does help. But putting rooms like garages and things that don't need the sun on the southern side of the house, and then uh, having the, your living spaces and, and you know big windows that where the sun can shine through, um, it is probably the the most or well, the cheapest the starting point. But if you're going to once you start to design a house around you know solar passive designs, then you get totally different designs. There's a lot. Lot has to change.